Hi, welcome. Today I would like to talk about how you can use uh, guards in your Angular application so that uh, when you want to go to a particular route, basically you could check if the user is authenticated to go to that route. If it is, uh, then it's allowed, otherwise it's not allowed. So let's get started. So uh, to start with, I basically have a route uh, uh, to which you can get to by clicking on the admin button and right now it's not guarded by anything so if you click on that admin you can go in there so the intent is that uh, if you hit the login button here I'm going to hit the login button for example and you can uh, refresh the local storage let's just see uh, local host colon 4200 and if I go in there just to make sure that the storage uh, is refreshed and you can see the logged in is true so the intent is if it is logged in only then you should be able to see the admin otherwise you won't be able to uh, go to the admin route and if i look at the storage is uh, is the same thing so let's just uh, take a quick look at the app and how you can do the guarding uh, basically in the guest component uh, when I hit the log on, I go to my API service and I say login admin. And if you want to take a quick look, all it is doing is it's setting an item and logged in as true. So to do the guard, basically what all you have to do is go into your router module. Here I'm saying that if I go to the admin, I'm going to this. And uh, here you just want to add what is called can activate, for example and you can pro, uh, see who is providing it and i'm saying my api service is going to provide that function and to provide that function i can uh, go to my api service and the way i'm going to provide that function is uh, i can say can activate and it is going to return what is in the local storage for example and i think i know how to do that basically i have a uh, read from the local storage converted into a boolean and i'm going to return that uh, value so now the thing is if the user is logged in you'll get that value otherwise you won't get that value logged in so let's just uh, make sure that the local storage is cleared here So I'm going to clear the local storage so the user is not logged in. So if I go to the admin route, you should really not see anything, which is the, the guard is doing his job. So now I'm going to say it log in. So now it's logged in and hopefully the guard should work and you should be able to get in. So to recap, uh, basically all you have to do is uh, provide a function called can activate where you can tell whether the guard can be activated or not and in your router modules you can provide the class which is going to do this and if you want to learn more in uh, details you can also go to the angular io website and learn through that information so thank you for watching this short screencast and i'm going to put this video on my website under angular to route guards thanks again